hopefully you guys have seen the main video that goes along with this. Um, if not, there's going to be a bunch of links everywhere, so it won't be hard to find. So in this video, what I kind of wanted to do was a behind the scenes take of um, the experiences that I had throughout this whole three day journey. What to expect in this video is more of like raw footage, just the challenges that I faced, some of the sights that I see, and then also a look into how I set up my shots and um, some of the gear that I use. I'm also a big advocate in not showcasing the exact location that I film at or a shoot, mostly because, you know, when something becomes too Instagram famous, then um, large numbers of people flock to that area and it kind of takes away from the, the serenity of it. And so what I like to do instead is give, a, give an overall location, a uh, general location of where I am, and then it's up to it's up to you to come over here and explore. Exploring a location and finding something on your own is where the adventure is. But yeah, let's get right into it. So according to uh, Google, it is currently 18 degrees uh, and it's expected to hit 8 degrees by 3 a.m. this morning. So not looking forward to that. <laughs> So it's about three o'clock and I'm gonna get the first set of shots. I'm gonna work my way up, um, get a bunch of shots up there and then just make my way down and then just get shots on the way down from there. Uh, I have my drone, I have my Sony with me and then I also have this setup, which is the, uh, the dolly rig that I'll be using. And also, I'll be using that as a tripod as well. Uh, yeah, I think right now the sun's at about like three o'clock. So I don't know. I may take my time. Is I'm just kind of like accounting for um, trying to figure out shots as I go. Um, but for the most part, I want to try and wait until maybe about 4:30, 4:30, 5 p.m. That you know that that pure golden hour. There's that challenge of lugging all this gear up rocks and hills like this I don't know maybe I should just do more cardio <laughs> because temperatures was about 28 degrees. Still cold, but way, way better than night number one. All right, so I'm going up for the, the big shot, the money shot. I'm going up for the, uh, the jump shot right now. Um, not too excited about the wind, but the lighting is right about eight o'clock in the morning and so I'm gonna try and use that to my advantage you gotta suck it up all right
full transparency to the uh, to the jumping shot. It was it's all quick cuts. So I filmed the uh, dangerous part up here on the cliff, but most of it was done here on the uh, safe safe zone. Um, the uh, the main the main shot was taken over here, but I cut right before right before the jump. Um, yeah, most of the drone shots is taken off of that, but the actual jump is going to take place probably on that boulder down there, on a safe, little safe environment. It's all movie magic. these hot springs. It's a little cold and windy out. It's gonna be nice. One thing that uh, scares me is this. So I definitely am not going to be putting my head underwater. That's for sure. So this is the part that I'm not looking forward to. It's getting out and drying off. Alabama Hills, you see it behind me. It's pretty awesome. hills I didn't get too many shots because it was super windy outside definitely didn't put up my drone I was I feel like I feel like the Mavic Air could have handled it but I just didn't want to risk it because I'm not about to go and search for a downed drone in the middle of nowhere yeah here's to the last sunset of 2020 Last shot of the trip over here in Alabama Hills. Uh, final shot, I wanna get on top of one of these boulders um, and then take a drone shot from there and then close off the video with that. Now, just have to figure out how to get up there.
lessons. So today's lesson, if you do get a drone, make sure to get the DJI refresh because accidents happen. And I don't know if you can see, but I crashed my drone. Basically, I had it on quick shot. There's no side collision detection, so it was it was going on this path. And I forgot to take into account that rock. So it basically crashed into there. I think it's worth noting that I have on my Survival is simple, just don't die. Creek Stewart. Alright, well that about wraps it up for this video. Thanks for watching.